Good evening, Marilyn. Eli? It's just the two of us today. Peter asked me to take this meeting. What? He's avoiding me. No. He has a scheduling conflict. For our last three meetings. It's been busy. Maybe you haven't heard. He's governor. You have a great talent for turning friends into enemies. Issue a report supporting the governor. And I'll be back in his good graces? No. Wow. Oh, he's deliciously manipulative. <laughs> That's a sneak peek from this Sunday's episode of the hit CBS drama, The Good Wife. Alan Cumming plays Eli Gold, a ruthless, we do mean ruthless with a capital R, campaign manager. But he's an actor, he's a singer, he's a writer, he's a director whose career has taken him from Broadway to TV and the movies. And Alan Cumming is here at the table. Hello, you. Hello, kids. Hello. It's a, hello, kid. <laughs> Listen, this is what's so funny about the character that you play because he's so nasty. But every now and again, you 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 show us a tender side. But when you first went to the show, Alan, you were just supposed to be just a minute. Yes. Well, he was just supposed to be for one episode. I know. And so yeah, you, and no, like, here you, know, you sit. So this later. is my question to you. Did you say I'm going to be so? Uh, I almost said damn good. I'm going to be so good that they're going to have to keep me. <laughs> um. No, you didn't? I didn't. I didn't. No, I didn't actually. I just thought. I thought I'll just. I thought, crikey, I have no idea what the heck I'm doing. <laughs> and so I'll just try and you know get through but it. But after and, one episode, were you hooked and thought I want to stay here? Well, after what one happened? episode, I was like, mm, quite like this. And then the next, they said, oh, you want to do the next episode? Then I was like, oh, and then the next one, next one, so the end of the season. So, so, but I, you know, they based him on. It's sort of based on Ram Emanuel. I heard that. Yes. So there's. I so I had that. some sort of idea of a hook of the kind of. Intensity of them, you know what I mean? And the current mayor of Chicago, and of mm. course the former chief of staff to, to President Barack Obama. So, what kind of research did you do? Yeah. <laughs> well, no, <laughs> not very much. I mean, I think you know, uh, Rahm Emanuel is such a strong personality. Even you know, I, I've never met him, oh. but I, you know, I read up a wee bit about him, and it's obviously a fictional character, sure. but he's got great traits. Like he's a very coiled spring. He's ruthless. He shouts a lot. Mm. Um, he's also got sort of this interesting site. Eli was used to be a concert pianist. Ram Emanuel was, was a, a ballet dancer. Was a dancer, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, so there's a fascinating sort of dichotomy there. So those were the sort of things I focused on. You're going back to Broadway? I'm actually yes, right, like in about half an hour. Yeah. I'm going to rehearsals for uh, to do cabaret again. After 16 years, I'm going back to be. Uh, there I am. How do you feel about that? How do you feel I feel exhausted, uh, Gail. I mean, <laughs> the thing oh, there's me smacking a girl's bum. Yeah. That's Kristen. <laughs> yeah, let me show you this. This is a clip when you and I appeared together. Uh, oh, in 1786. Yes, indeed. <laughs> 1998. Yeah. The play itself. You didn't want to do it because? Well, I had a very, you know, I'm kind of um, prejudiced against, I was prejudiced against musicals, really. I had, I can't, I really can't do that thing. Where does this come from? Just because I'm never really, ignorance, really, you know. And also, I don't like these modern musicals where everyone's sort of singing like, ah, 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 and and it's all about something important, and yet the songs are all just kind of glorified pop songs. I think that's a bit crass. And this is not like this at all. Another thing I can't do is uh, I can't do speaking and then suddenly singing. I just couldn't do that. Wow. Oh, yes, I can. Yes. yes. <laughs> Our times have changed. Are you nervous about going back after 16 years? Uh, well, you know, you'd think I should be, uh, being an ancient old hag, doing something that was difficult hag. even then. But no, I'm actually really enjoying it. I'm just looking. It's such fun. And the good thing about muscle memory is that it actually exists. It's not just a concept. Hmm. Like, it comes back into your body in a way which oh, is really? very heartening when you think you're not going to remember it. Dance steps are hard to, for... I'm not a dancer, and yet, you know... So it's actually, I'm really looking forward to it more than being scared. Alan Cumming uh, tweeted you guys this morning, watch me. It, somebody said, watch you on CBS this morning. You said, yeah, I'm a hoot at 8.30 in the morning. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this is tough getting up for you, huh? It's, well, it is, yeah, I'm going to, this is a big day because I've got you guys and then I'm going to rehearsals and then I'm going to the Good Wife to shoot in the Good Wife this evening. Wow. So, you know, I'm it's double dipping, triple it's dipping. It's called multitasking. Oh, um, I know all about that, you. Gail. You know. And, and it's thanks for wearing yeah. those pants this morning. And these great, these pants um, were, were my father-in-law's. Who yeah. sadly is no longer with us, but I'm wearing them in his honor today Very for Ron. Good. And, and you wear them well, Alan. You wear Thanks. them well. Good to see you. You, you can see Alan on The Good Wife Sunday nights at 9, 8 Central here on CBS, and soon on Broadway.